I left it after that floor, yeah? I left it completely. I even came to Sora before I put up that video. I came to him here. Gary was there. Gary was there. Gary can confirm to you what I'm saying is truth or not, yeah? And I came to him in a non threatening way to begin with. And I said to him, Sora, please, do you mind if me and you just go over over there and just talk uh, alone? So just as when I went to Callum originally and people were coming to film, I said, no, 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 please, please, please. Yeah? Uh, Raspik can confirm that. Inshallah, Raspik can confirm that. Gary was there and I said, please, can I talk to you alone? Why? I wanted to say to Sora, Sora, please, can you stop these videos in your car? You slagging me off all the time saying I'm a coward, I back down. Eh, eh. So he didn't do that. So that's when some people started pulling me off. I was pushing them away from me. It looked as if I was in that kind of hold me back situation. I'm not that guy, bro. Brother, bro, bro, listen, listen. I mean, go on. You said I was there. Yes, go on. Now tell me, I'm going to tell you a lie now. You, now this is Ramadan, yes? Yes. You said that you would break your fast right now to go. 10 bells of Sarah. Did, did you say that? No, it's no, take the context. Gary, no, I know. Gary, but, but you say Gary, if you, you know, if you know Gary, and address the context. You down, if you it? know Gary, address the context of everything I know. before. I know. Why did I, I say, there. no, no, no. Why did I say, why did I go to this point? Why? Okay, okay. Why is that not addressed? Oh, okay. Why is it always spotlight when you see me break a sweat? Okay, cool. Why is there no spotlight on, on what aggravated okay. me? Yes, I was aggravated. Okay. Listen, listen. Look, I'm talking to the camera. I'm talking to the camera. Listen, me and you, we've never had a confrontation. Me and you, never had a confrontation. AR23, Michael, me and him had a confrontation and we shook it off. We had it out. We spoke like men. We had Ebony and Ivory playing in the background. It was all banner, it was all fun and games and laughter, yeah? I'm not the kind of guy that goes around saying that I'm some anything, bro. With Sara, no, no problem, brother, no problem. With Sara, he aggravated the situation. He did. Allah, he did. He aggravated it. When he came up to me, when I said to him, come and talk to me alone, he came with a camera on, with, with, with COE's camera on. This is before I knew Leon and his team, yeah? With COE camera on, no, no, hooded no, 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 up, no, no. with gloves on, coming up to me. Like, <laughs> he's bad. Listen, he can do that again if he wants. Like, I don't, I don't think, just like Hamid said, I'm going to say the same thing. I fear no man but Allah. I'll say to the cameras again, this is wallahi, wallahi, this is not for to make myself look bad. I believe that Sarah is a blatant coward. And what I'm saying to you is this, bear man like you, bear man like you, no, bear man like you, bear man like you, let me finish, please bro, yeah, please. Thank you so much. Bear man like you, AR23, Michael here. When I see you lot, I look at you in your face, you're not cowards. And a man can tell a man, unless you can stand there and tell me, Mo, you're a coward. I'll say, all right, cool, if you think I'm a coward, you think I'm a coward. Yeah, but Sarah is a coward. And we are all fighting. It's like, it's like, you know what it's like? It reminds me of. It reminds me of old school tribes in Arabia or in Africa or anywhere in the world that fight over women and respecting their honor. If he's a big man, the way people keep saying he's a big man, then why doesn't he come? Look, bro, I'm telling you now. Wallahi, if Sarah comes, I will talk to him gently with respect and honor like a man. Wallahi, he doesn't want that. He doesn't want it, bro. You know you when you come, when you talk, wallahi, I see sometimes you talk with a, with a passion and with some sincerity in what you're saying. He doesn't do that, bro. He comes, he puts a video on when he knows, when he knows that I will address him. He wants to fight me, he wants to come and say, I will fight him in a car park. You're saying that just like what you said, just like what you said, yeah, that you're not gonna get any incriminating evidence of you to go and do some law uh, against the law in a car park. I went up to him after that and I said, listen, Leave your cameras aside and let's talk like men, innit? And he doesn't want that, bro. He puts a video up and says, Mo's a coward. If I'm a coward, where are you? Like, why are you standing? I'm telling you, the guy that you are defending, you are a man. You are a man. He's a man. I'm a man. We are all men. Sorrow's not a man. Can, can I just say to you? Can I just say to you? First and foremost, first and foremost, first and foremost, yeah. First and foremost, I defend. Yeah, I defend your right to have any opinion that you want of Sarah. And that's and, and, and that's fine because that's your subjective opinion of Sarah. However, let me just say this. There are different types of war and there are different types of cowardice. The, the person that you describe Sarah as, I don't see that person. Because now this is my opinion, even though it's subjective. Let me tell you what I see. I see a clever man, a man who is married. A man who has two children, a man who has responsibilities, a man whose responsibilities include paying his bills, putting food on the table and ensuring that his children, his children have a father to come home to at night. A little bit of what you're speaking about, with the greatest respect, 
sounds a little bit like when we was at school. Somebody said this, so let's meet round the back of the bike park so we can have a fist up. That works when you're 16, 17, 18. Wait, give me a second, I mean. When you're 36, when you're, 30, when you're 35, 36, and you're trying, you're trying to enable a 36-year-old married man with two children to come out to put his best interest to one side to fulfill what you believe is your perception of a man, you understand? I believe that's where you're mistaken. I don't believe, I don't believe that Sarah is a coward at all. In fact, I know as a statement of fact that he is not a coward. This is where the danger, now this is where the danger lies, yeah? And hear me out a second, because you perceive him to be a coward, and one or two other people may well perceive him to be a coward. Let's just say, for example, that he is not a coward, and you're not a coward, and then a clash comes. What's going to happen? Let me tell you what's going to happen. One person, one person probably lives injured. The other person probably dies for his injury. The person who lives goes to prison. Probably is going to have to do a minimum of 25. You understand? Whilst he's in jail, he loses any ability to be free again in this life to be a father if you're not married yet, to have the ability to be married, to have the ability to have children. So when we, we have to be very careful when we have all of this YouTube stuff. This is the reason why I scrub my stuff because I saw, I saw where this was going to go and not just from me. What I saw was that there were other people who loved me who would have taken separate action, which I would never have supported under no circumstances. In fact, there was one guy when we was over with Hamza and he came and there was three or four of them and he said, it's okay, bro. It's okay, big bro, we're with you when it picks. And I went to them, and you watching in the camera? I said, no, 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 no. We deal with this intellectually, yeah, because the fighting thing is too easy. So when you're gonna be, you can't, there's a cognitive dissonance with you, Mohammed. I'm telling you the truth. Because you can't, on one hand, be saying that, you know what, I'm prepared to have a discussion with Sarah, and yet in the next breath, well, I'm telling you, and I'm gonna look at the camera, and, and he's a coward, and he's blah, blah, blah. Brother, brother, that's the reason why, not only would he not have a conversation with you, I would advise him, yeah, I would advise him not to have a conversation because there is too much, there is too much emotionalism in this and then it's going to kick off. Nobody I wants, it, nobody who is intelligent, I agree with, nobody who is intelligent agree with your, wants it to kick I off. I agree with something you said, look, I believe very, very clearly, look, of course, look, what I, what I give off on YouTube, of course I've got a personal life as well and I choose, I am the boss of what I give off in, on YouTube and what I give off off YouTube, yeah? Now, there is part of my personal life that many people don't know here, but that's fine. What I will say is this, a man who looks after his children and his family, his wife, the women in his family, he's a man. He is a man. No one no. says no. If Sarah, is do, if Sarah does that, he's a man. You're well, a man you know that, that he does that. And I salute you. What you I will know say that is he this, does listen, that. I promise you, one thing, you know at this point, you don't know who the Wallahi, you don't know him. Listen, Wallahi, you don't know him. Wallahi, you don't know him. We don't know anything about him. Yeah, but half his uncle. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, may Allah expose me if I was the propagator or I had anything to do with the propagation or any knowledge on the phone calls or the threats or the emails or the anything to do with the Sara situation. However, he was audacious enough online to say it was Muhammad from Guidance Avenue that had, and do you know what's so funny about it? Wallahi, do you know the first time I heard about it was when it was said, was when it was when the accusation came my way. Not even when it happened. Not when the crime happened, when the accusation was pointing at me. Bro, listen, as I just said, I'm on the camera, I'm saying again, Sarah, if you look after your family, you look after your, if you do have a wife and you look after your wife and you do have children and you look after them, you're a man. Then for that, he's a man. The reason why I said, the reason why I said, the reason, the reason, okay, listen. Do you know what I said, Gary? The reason why I said that guy is but a coward is this. Which is a precursor. No problem. It's, it's all right, all right, he is. Because I don't know him personally. No, you, know, but you, you, know, you know the situation. Never, I will never ask a man's business to another man. No, but from you another man. No problem. No problem. I'll take your word for it. One thing I will say is this, look, the reason why I say he's a coward, and I'll still stand to say he's a coward. He's a man and with his family. Opinion. The reason for that, bro, the reason that I say this is because the guy came with the hat ready to fight. Don't come with the camera and turn it off and then give me give me one of my face and I'll give you my other cheek. Do that. Fight me like a man without the cameras, without the YouTube. If not, sorry, so I don't mean you're to. You're the one that, you're the one that made the threat, though, Tahi. You're the one that made the threat. It aggravates me. 
No, no, I never made a physical threat. I never made a physical threat. I never made a physical threat. I never made a What do you mean? You said that you deliberately pulled him out. Yeah, you deliberately pulled him out. When I pulled him out, what did I say? What did I say? Sir, sir, all I'm saying to you what did I say? No, no, please. You said I made a physical threat. I made a threat, but it wasn't physical. What was the threat then? I said, I was. I said, you make me feel like I'm going to lash out. That could be verbal. It could be physical. It could be anything. All right, bro, listen. You read that in court. No, but listen. Listen, listen, listen. If, if I went in court, if I said lash out, yeah, I, could, I couldn't mean verbally. Has he not lashed out verbally against me on videos? Has he not lashed out through writing on videos? Do you understand? So why physical when it comes to the Arab with the beard? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, one minute. When it comes to the Arab with the beard, it's physical. One minute, one minute, let me just say to you. Let me just say to you. And then he puts out videos and he says I'm a coward. Hold on, you need to calm, you need to calm down a second, yeah? Let me tell you also what you did. Yeah, just so we're very clear, because you're saying that the man's a coward. Yes. You then went and you made a video yeah, you made a video and you also gave him three options. Do you understand? This is what you did. I'm asking you, I'm asking you, if, if and when you do that, bearing in mind how it started, I'm saying, do you then as a Muslim, follow, do you as a Muslim say then with that behaviour that you're following, you're following the Surat al mustaqim Allah SWT? I'm just asking you. Yeah? What I will say I'm asking is, you. our Prophet, I'm going to ask you. Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He had intestines of animals thrown on him. He was spat on. He had stones thrown on him from the children uh, uh, in, by instruction of their parents, and he never retaliated the way I retaliated on something petty. May Allah subhanahu wa taala only give us the patience and the insight into being closer to Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. I am very religious, a man, and I have not been given revelation from Allah. My heart was not cleansed when I was a child from malaika, from the instruction of Allah, and I am not on the same level as Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, even from. A Brain. What I will say, bro, is that as I said in the beginning, I am very, very clear to say that for me to have lashed out like that, I'm sure Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam wouldn't have done it. Yeah? But sir, so you I, made I a just, video. I just addressed you. Yeah, but you made a video. Why did I do that? Oh, why did I do that? But do you know what you, you know keep why doing? I did that video? Yeah, okay, guys, do you know why I did that video? No, it's not, you know. I did that. You know, bro, I did, you know, bro, I did that video. Can I say something? Look, bro, the thing is this, look. This whole thing started between us and Sarah. And look what we're getting at. No, big, big, big. Look, where is this, he? This, where is look, he? Look, 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 men are fighting. Look, men are fighting for Sarah. Look, 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 do you know why? It's a free speech yes, issue. Look, I, I because I've seen people, yes. I've seen people try, yes. try to intimidate, to intimidate Ty and disrespect Ty. Okay. Okay. Wait a second. Come here. They tried to, they tried to, they tried to intimidate and threaten physically Ty. Now say. What I've you never like. seen that, by the way. No, but I have. Yeah, but say what you yeah. like about Ty. Yeah. Ty has a very unique way of speaking. Yeah. Is it so my rude. way? So no, 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 I'm just saying to you. So, I know you can say Ty is rude, and, and let's, you let's have a right. Please, no, 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 but yeah, hold but a second. I am, I am leveling. No, 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 no. He, he has a different way. To be or not to be. He has. Let me tell you. Can I just say to you? Can I just say to you? For me, Ty is one of the brightest guys in the park. Now, you might not see it. You might not see it, and you have a right not to see it. I'm telling you what I see. I think that Ty is three or four levels yeah, ahead of what anybody is in the park. I could only wish to have the knowledge that that guy has. Some people may say, well, we don't like the way in which he speaks. And I get that, because it's like Marmite. Either you like it, or either you don't. But what is it about Ty? We have never seen Ty threaten anybody. We've never oh, seen him, see just give me 10 seconds, please, um, Ty. We've never seen him physically threaten anybody. We've never seen him intimidate anybody. So why then was somebody like Ty threatened? I know you think this is about Sarah, but it's not. It's about free speech. Because when, when somebody like Ty has to say to me, look, if you attack me, yeah, then my sons will come down here and it will carry on. We all know that's not how Ty speaks. So what is it that put Ty in that position that Ty had to say that? So it's not just about Sarah. So you're it's anybody. About the issue with Hijabi. No, no, no. I'm that just video. speaking generally. I'm, so, I'm speaking. Ge no, 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 no. I'm speaking generally that it's not about Sarah. It's about the issue of free speech within the confines of speakers' corner. I think let, let us just end on a note that I think we we'll all agree that we're not going to agree on the issue of free speech. That's that's clear. At least, at least I hope that we are in agreement 
that if there was any previous grievance between us, enmity. hopefully, or enmity, at least from our side. There was none from me. Okay, that's fair enough. There was at none least, from at me. At least that we know where we all stand, that we, we, I hope that we can continue in peace from now on. Sure, that from now on, if I hear something, I put it on camera as well. If I hear anything from you, or Sarah, which I deem to be slanderous, or which I deem to be insult, you with the impact on camera. I will walk away, I will not listen to Sora. In fact, I will make it clear now that I will keep my distance from Sora because I believe he will not change. I believe he won't change. And I don't believe that we should ask you guys to get him to change because he won't change anyway. Fair enough. So let's just end it there. Let, let us just let us just let, 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 let us just let us just end on that note that we agree to disagree and that there was any previous grievances, we squashed that and we made peace. Although maybe we was there was nothing to make peace in the first place, but I believe that I apologize for my for my wrong doings, I did it as me bro, or anyone that took offense to what I said. That hopefully maybe this can be a catalyst for any future agreement between us and Sara, maybe he can if he watches this, that he knows that the best way to say what you want is not by insulting. Is how you say it. I hope if he watches this, he learns this. Because you might have the right to say some things, but sometimes it's better that you at least adjust the way you say things for the greater good. The same way Big Bro does it, the same way you do it, the same other brothers do it. That we know that we have a right to say something, however, for the greater cause, not to cause offense to our fellow human beings, we adjust it slightly. And we can still say what we want, we can still critique, you know, but we adjust it. You know, in this is to wisdom. This now, it's in, wisdom. In addition to this, now let me say something. Wallahi, it's not for justification of my actions. Wallahi, is for, as you said, uh, free speech in a park and for the overall image of the park. Inshallah, if Sarah is watching this, bro, please, I invite you kindly to reconsider to come down to the park and speak to me off camera. If you don't want it off camera, we can do it on camera and it will be well, free I can tell you now, that's not going to work. Free, because, free because, because when I said to you, you're, up, you're up, down, up, down, up, down, up, yeah, down, up, down. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Then he shouldn't have aggravated the sleeping lion. Well, 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 can I just say to you? He shouldn't have aggravated the sleeping lion. There's more than one lion. There's more than one lion in the world. You understand? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's more than one lion in the world. Let me tell you. But the one that poked me Let me tell you. Let me just say to you. We've been... Yeah. I'm saying that, but then you're right. saying he would definitely right. say no. No, but you, you, you see, if he carries on putting videos you, about me you, online, like, well, I said to you, what I said to you, what I said to you, is that if I spoke to you, if I spoke to my brother, if I spoke to my brother, and I said, and my brother said to me, should I speak to Pamukawi? I would say no. And the reason why is because I've not seen anything from you here today that would conclude me to say go there. And I'll tell you the reason why. Not because you're a coward or he's a coward. I do not want this guy to put his marriage at risk. Yeah, no, hear me a second. I don't want him to put his marriage at risk, his, his, his statement of a father at risk by coming down and dealing with juvenile, yeah, dealing with juvenile behavior. Sir, let me just I'll talk to him, to him away from the You already have a problem, it's not going to happen. You can search me for weapons before I go It's got nothing to do with that. I'll even lift my tongue. That's the reason why. Your reaction, your reaction, your reaction. Your reaction, your reaction I'll talk to you away from the car. Your, your reaction, you can, stand you can be there, be there as a mediator, no, 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 vigilator. No, 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 no. Do you see what I'm saying? No, I'm saying I'm here to promote peace. You've been trained by me for 20 years. Yeah. You've got to figure out that shit. Sorry. Come on, guys. Listen, let's, let's, listen, guys, come guys, on, guys, guys, come guys, 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 come on now. Guys, come on. Listen, listen, listen. What I'm saying, can I, that was any man with two fists can fight. Okay, we're not saying that. Of course you can fight. The quality of the fight. Look, guys, otherwise anybody, otherwise anybody can fight for this. You said he's going to rip my heart out of my chest. We have to stop him. One, 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 Bro, he made a death threat against me. Yeah. He did. He made a death threat against me. How? And I'm still standing here saying. In response will, to what? In response to me saying, and you didn't come and talk to me. I'll confront no, you. Know but it was it, it was, I never made a physical threat against him. Leave it I never. Leave it Leave it Leave it Leave it Look, guys. Even till now, I never made a physical threat against him. Muhammad. Leave it Guys. As I said to you. As I said to you. As I said, no, one minute, please, yeah. One minute. As I said. Yeah, me too. I'm going to go over a bit. As I said to you, I'm very shocked. But, but. I'm going to tell you, because I'm not a hypocrite, 
Yeah, and I'm going to turn it to your face. You understand? You need to learn to control yourself because you see, real bravery. Yeah, real bravery. Give me something. Real bravery isn't a lion going down and tearing up everybody. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I attacked one person in the park. Sir, sir, sir. Hear me a second. So to say that is quite. Hear me a second. Hear me a second. And I've told you that, like, I've seen you being disrespectful to three or four people in the park on video. But just take my advice when I say to you. Please tell me who they are. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Just hear me a second. No problem. Okay. Give me a second. Sure. All I'm telling you is. You don't have to take this on, you don't have to take this on board. I always say this, even to my friends. Yeah, if I'm going to say something, I said I'm going to say it once, and then that's it. I'm going to walk away. And then afterwards, whatever happens, happens. But I'm telling you this, even if you go back and you look at this video, yeah, today, because I thought, I thought, and I didn't like some of the stuff that I mean say. I just didn't. Yeah, I didn't. So I came down here to confront that, to deal with that. However, after being here today, yeah, I've now realized that commit is not the problem. Yeah, that's the truth. Do you understand? In part, I believe that you are. And one of the reasons why... <laughs> no, 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 hear me, hear me. No, 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 you understand. No, 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 hear me a second and then you'll understand what I'm saying. That hear was, me. That was a lie. No, 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 hear me, hear me, hear me. And I'm going to tell, you, I'm, I'm gonna tell you what I mean by that. What I mean by that is that there is nothing wrong with having that vigor and that zeal for what you believe in. Nothing wrong. Everybody would want someone to have that vigor and to have that zeal. But whatever you say is going to be lost in the fog because of your up and down, of your up and down character. Now, one of the reasons why, because even when you watch the video, like you were this one minute, then you were this one minute, then you were this one minute, then you were this. And let me just say to you, one of the reasons, one of the reasons, one of the, let me just tell you this one second. One of the reasons why I'm not going to condemn you, yeah, me, is the same reason why I said I wouldn't condemn Muhammad Hijab. And you know the reason why that is? It's because you're young. You understand? And when you're young, you sometimes have that vigor. I'm not trying to be funny. You sometimes have that vigor and that fight. Let me just say, if I was going somewhere and I, was, I knew I was going to have an argument and I could bring a dozen men with me who's 40 or a dozen men with me who's your age, I'd bring a dozen men with me who's 40. You know the reason why? Because they can reason their That's wives. That's exactly right. But with your age, with your age, because I was oh, there. No, 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 but you understand what I mean. In terms of that, in terms of that ignorance, nobody here wants to paint themselves as paragons of virtue. Do you understand? Because I certainly am not, by no stretch of the imagination, am I a paragon of virtue. However, I'm telling you this in terms of words of advice. You can give the most brilliant dawa to date in the park. Somebody then watches the upside down nature of, of the video and they say to themselves, do you know what, there's something which is not quite right. I actually think that Hamid, yeah, got it right, you understand? And he has now moved over to the winning side. And I'll tell you what I mean by that without being divisive. You know when somebody says that when I see Sarah from now on, I'm now going to go over there. If he's over there, I'm going to completely ignore him. There are some people in life, Mohammed, who rely on the oxygen, yeah, who rely on the oxygen of publicity to exist. You understand? And there is no existence without it. I'm saying that if Sarah is over there, he has a right to say what he says. But if you are nowhere near him, if people who believe as you believe are nowhere near him, who then is he going to be speaking to? I'm just asking you. So you might think this is an attack, but if you're clever, when you go home and watch the video, you'll realize that this is not an attack at all. Yeah? This is a next brother. Yeah? This, is a, this is a next brother. This is, this, is, this is a next brother, because let me tell you this. We all know, we all know, apart from the liars and the hypocrites who will say, you have to be jailed, you know, we want, and if anything, go, go jail and blah, blah, blah. These guys, these guys, there's something seriously wrong with them. Do you understand? Because prison, prison, despite what they tell you, is not a good place. It's not a decent place. It's a soul-destroying place. Why then would you want to put yourself in a position to go somewhere like that? Do you understand? It's nonsense. It's crazy. That's what I wanted to say. Listen, I'll take, I'll take your words of advice. Okay. Now, if I look a certain way, the one who I am actually worried about the way he sees me, first and foremost, is Allah the Exalted. The Muslim. The judge. Now, 
You know what you were saying, bro, about the way I'm going up and down and the fact that yes. I'm being very... Over-emotional. Over-emotional, for example, and maybe uh, aggravational, yeah. provocative at the moment. Please note again, and I'll say it again, please. Please note that, as I said, there was a time where Sarah was provoking and provoking, and I stayed quiet, I stayed silent, and he continued. So this, what you see of me now, is a result of many months. This thing between you and Hamid is only a, it's like, it's a moment. Sorry. It's, Sorry. A, it's a moment. This thing with me and Sarah is like a year, and he's actually weaned of this YouTube glamour. He's weaned of it to try and make an image with me. People <laughs> know me more, uh, know me just as much as they know that I give da'wah. They know me because of the Sarah situation, which I detest. I don't like it. And I've spoken to Sarah a number of times of, away from camera, and I said, Sarah, please, let me speak to you off camera. Oh, no, you do you, I do me. Okay, if, if I do me and you do you, why are you then going back online and saying I'm a coward, saying I'm this, saying I'm that, like chill out man. It's because he wanted something before. Well, Wahi, I'm telling you, all right, I'm not perfect. I know I'm not perfect. Of us are perfect. And I, I don't care saying it to you too. No, 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 I have perfect. no idea, thank you. But one, and I will take your advice. As an elder, I, will, I respect that and I take your advice. Because verily, we know even from Hadith that Iblis himself spoke the word of Haq to recite ayat al kursi from night until morning at one point and there are variations of this hadith and the, the, the symbolism behind it is to take truth wherever it comes from it doesn't matter if it comes from it's true. a black skin brother or an asian brother or a muslim or a, or a kafir or anything it doesn't matter if truth comes you should accept it and that's it because truth is truth bro i swear to god wallahi allah knows best i am not here for youtube fame i am here to pull people towards the truth i started this when i had a health condition sawa came and approached me and he said i will rip your heart out he may have been, it may have been a, a result response of a response. what you said. Yeah, exactly though, it's a response of what I said and I never brought up um, a threat, physical. Well, why? He never ever did it sounded that. like a threat though. No, man. maybe it's because I've got a uh, strong personality. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it was a misunderstanding. Yeah, Callum, yeah. another thing as well. It sounded like a threat though. And another thing as well, yeah. Callum, Callum himself. When Sarah was over there and Sarah said, oh, you called me a bastard. Mind my language, you called me a bastard. And I turned to Callum and I said, Callum, did you tell him I called him a bastard? In the video I said, did I call him a bastard? Callum stayed quiet because he knows that I never said this. I said things that I've, I've said on camera today. I said, you're a homosexual, bring the homo to me or the gay to me with YMCA, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. which is fine. All right, I said it, I'm saying that. Listen, 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 listen. All right, cool, let me, listen, all right, let me finish, can, finish, can finish, 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 off. finish off. Let me finish off, let me finish off. You're the peaceful one now. No, 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 no. Go to drink your coffee. No, there's I nothing need to, wrong uh, with that. <laughs> there's nothing I'm wrong sorry, with listen, that. let me finish it. Nothing wrong I'm with sorry, that. bro, listen. Yeah, I've got nothing. I've got nothing personally. Wallahi. I've got nothing personally against Sarah. It's the actions of a man that I detest. Just like you haven't got anything personal against me, it's my actions you detest, right? Yeah. Because you don't know me well enough to know if you no. Thank you. It's the same thing. Likewise. I've got nothing against Sarah. It's the actions that I detest. Yeah, but when you, um, can I just say the last thing here yeah, before we finish? When you're going to say somebody's a batty man, yeah, when you're going to say somebody's a batty man and somebody's a homosexual, you know, do you know what I said when, when, when they said online? And I was actually being very sincere. I said that your language should be very careful, yeah, because Sarah was an actor 15, 16 years ago. Yeah, there are men in the park, yeah, who are batty men, yeah, who have had numerous men that they've slept with, and you lot defend them when they're down here giving dawah. So I've never understood, I've never understood that you could point your hands at Sarah, who is not a batty man, but you actually have batty men then down here. And don't get me wrong, I'm not attacking any of them down here. I have no right, you understand, to judge another man, you understand? I'm only mentioning it in relation to how you're, you're seeking to judge Sarah. Sarah is a married, heterosexual man looking after his wife and his two children. Do you understand? He is not a homosexual, but they're, 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 he they're everybody. He's not bisexual. Do you understand? He's a heterosexual you know, man. You're right. I, disagree. I, I disagree. You with should the comment. apologize for saying I disagree. that. To say what? You should apologize for calling Sarah a butter man. That's what you should do. You, let me tell you the reason why. Let me tell you. And you know the thing is, this does not take away from you, you know. Yeah, it doesn't take away from you. Just like me, I came down to the park no, and I take away from no, you. No, 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 it doesn't take away from you. Also, I'm apologizing. Why don't you bring him down? Yeah, yeah. Let, let, all. Let, let, let's, yeah? let's all of you in person. Yeah, bring him down there. Away from you the park. Here. You and you can strip us. Strip 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 but you can search us. The point I wanted to make was a serious point. Why would you not talk to us? The point. Why not? If you're a mediator, the point. I'll tell you why. Four of us in front of the camera. And you be a media, okay? You know the thing is, yeah, you can be the arbitrator if you want. I'm I'm you can be the I do not have any social media accounts. 
and if you remember, I said that I don't like, I don't actually like the whole filming shit. Yeah? Leon and them will tell you, they have refused, they've asked me, they are 23, everybody, everybody has asked me. I've got two speaking engagements out of, out of Hyde Park, yeah, yeah. Yeah, one in Seattle, one in New York, you understand? I will speak there. Yeah. I saw you the Bristol Tower as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. when I was at the Brent Cup. Yeah. The, the point that I'm making is that, is that most people misunderstand people like myself. Yeah. People like myself have seen what it's been for people who look like me, yeah, my skin colour, our experience in this country. That anger that we see doesn't come from out of the clear blue sky. Yeah.